What's up everybody? Big Ice Triple Six here, the Goth Gamer. And check it out, this will be my first impressions of Detroit Become Human demo. Now, I don't know if this is actually gonna be the release of the gameplay wise because to me the controls are very very clunky I hope they get that stuff polished but you know this game comes out I think like sometime next month so I hope they get it polished because it just feels like the older games if you haven't heard of quantum dreams they're the people that made interactive games sort of like heavy rain for the ps3 which is an amazing game if you haven't seen it play this game you must play if you like interactive games and also beyond two souls for the PS3. Now, you can actually buy Beyond Two Souls and Heavy Rain on a PS4. You have to import it, but it's still the PS4 is um, region free, so you can pretty much play anything from the Japanese and, and whatever. So that's a pretty good deal. If you haven't played these games, um, Beyond Two Souls is very, very clunky. Same thing of Heavy Rain is very, very clunky. And it has that same um, pretty much feel of Heavy Rain and Beyond Two Souls got very very clunkiness. Don't get me wrong, it's 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 a pretty game. Okay. It's a very pretty game. But this version right here is the um hostage situation where pretty much you try to save the little kid and either save the uh, person with the with the gun or pretty much kill him. Which I was kinda of disappointed of the ending that I, I got. And what I like about Heavy Rain and Beyond Two Souls, just like um, Detroit Become Human, they have multiple endings. So there's a bunch of replay value um, on this game. That's why I platinum Heavy Rain because I enjoyed it so much. Because there was like 18 different endings that you could you could go through, which was pretty freaking cool. And every choice that you make will have some type of consequence. Even Picking up that freaking fish will have some type of consequences. I don't know, I don't know how, but it will. But um, games like this are amazing. But some people do not like games like this because it doesn't have enough action to it. It's just pretty much you go walk around and and do stuff. Which I understand the heavy rain part of the FBI agent pretty much going to an murder scene and and looking around clues and stuff like that it's basically the same part right here which was kind of kind of mad but I can understand what, the, what they were trying to try um, get around but the controls on here is just like oh annoying as heck I don't know what they're they're trying to do because you have to like I know they have the stuff from Heavy Rain and Beyond Two Souls but it's just awful Really, really, really awful. The the walking around and stuff. It just I, I always knocked like ran into something at the like second half of this game of this demo. Um, it was just annoying as fuck. <laughs> you know, it just felt like a PS3 game. But it's it looks beautiful. I have to give it that. It looks amazing. And I will show you the ending of the part where I was trying. You know, talk to the person that kidnapped the girl and stuff like that held a hostage and see my results but it looks pretty cool I hope it, it'll be a great game and um it just uh, they I hope they actually fix the controls on this thing because it just felt like it to me it really did but that's my opinion let me know in the comment section below what you guys think about Detroit Become Human and if you ever gonna play this game but this is Big Ox Triple Six y'all stay awesome and I will be playing the rest of the rest of this game the very the my hostage situation my results after this but yes looks pretty hope they pause the game and yeah we have to just wait and see but I see you guys next time thanks for watching and I hope you enjoy and also open your mind playing different type of video games Bye, guys. Stay back! Don't come any closer or I'll jump! No, no, please, I'm thinking... I know you're angry, Daniel. You need to trust me and 
Let me help. I don't want your help. Nobody can help me. All I want is for all this to stop. I, I just want all this to stop. Are you armed? No. I don't have a gun. You're lying. I know you have a gun. I'm telling you the truth, Daniel. I came here unarmed. They were going to replace you, and you became upset. That's what happened, right? I thought I was part of the family. I thought I mattered. But I was just their toy. Something to throw away when you're done with. I know you and Emma were very close. You think she betrayed you, but she's done nothing wrong. She lied to me! I thought she loved me. But I was wrong. She's just like all the other humans. Daniel, no! <laughs> Listen. I know it's not your fault. These emotions you're feeling are just errors in your software. No. It's not my fault. I never wanted this. I love them. You know? But I was nothing to them. Just a slave to be ordered around. I can't stand that noise anymore. And tell that helicopter to get out of here. snipers on every roof. Let the hostage go. You have no other choice. Please. I want everyone to leave. Please help me. And, and I want a car. When I'm outside the city, I'll let her go. That's impossible, Daniel. Let the girl go, and I promise you won't be hurt. I don't want to die. You're not going to die. We're just going to talk. Nothing will happen to you. You have my word. Okay. I trust you. Connor. You lied to me. 